Well, we got another, another, another running sign out, another setup. <laughs> Friendly neighbor. While I was testing out my setup in the house, which I mean, it makes me sure it worked. I noticed. Oh, I can't. Who who commented on that? But the, my bike trunk. But anyway, one thing I gotta say about that is, yeah, it's big. It's gotta fit my big old fat helmet. And uh, I also, if you uh, we'll go back to the original owner of this bike, take a look what he had on the back end of this thing. Yeah, it was huge too. So. Yeah, it's big, and I know it. Don't you don't have to say anything about that. I mean, if anything's going to fit my helmet, it's going to be huge. Figured I'd run up through here. Oh, look at that! Look at that! It's a garage sale. Test this microphone out. This works. I'll ride with it. If it doesn't, I'll have to figure something out. What had happened is I played around, I shielded the cords, I shielded everything, and still got that freaking hum. So, what I did end up doing is I took the uh, microphone out of the my old microphone. I didn't. I, ended, I did throw it away, but I ended up finding it. I think my cat was playing with it. To be honest with you. Um, what I ended up doing is unsoldering the microphone off the cord because I knew it was a cord. It was just, it was just cord bad. And went ahead and soldered to the new cord. Now, as long as I'm not getting feedback through the cord, I'm, I mean, I should be rocking and rolling for a while. But I was planning on giving that other microphone, my spare microphone, away to somebody. It ain't happening. I ain't giving away a piece of junk. Would I try the cheaper microphones again? Yeah, I'd give them a try. I mean, uh, I did get a bad batch, but I would I'd make sure to order it from somebody else. And the, the mayor, suburban rider, actually tried to help me on it, and I thank him on that, because he said it does sound like a uh, 60 megahertz hum to try shielding it and see how it works. Well, it didn't help, <laughs> and I put a lot of a lot of foil around the cord and. A, up to the microphone and I used electrical tape like he said could work on it and everything and it just it just didn't work so evidently that wasn't the problem it's a shame and it looks like that my, my co-partner that was supposed to go to Ohio with me might be backing out. We'll have to see. He's having vehicle troubles. But that's okay. I mean, I mean it's not okay for him, but it's okay for me. I mean, we, we will still rock and roll, you know? And no, I'm not heading down uh, this road to go on home. We're not done yet. I'm working on this microphone. I, my gut feeling says it's going to be okay. So I'm riding. I mean, this microphone, the, the actual microphone part itself, has done me very well for a long time. And uh, I, if this works out for me, I mean, I'm going to be totally thrilled, yes. 
but I'm not going to promote Sony by taking a chance of buying the mic, buy cheap microphones like I used to. Kind of learned my lesson on that. But I know. I know that uh, either way I'll, I'll prevail one way or another. Might take me a little bit longer to finish it if this doesn't help. Always work. Pedestrians always take over. I think that should be the. I think that's law in most places too. If I'm mistaken. I do something with my glove. I know down here by the uh, industrial area, it's whenever it really starts humming out bad. Oh, to go back to what the uh, previous owner had on NT8, he uh, actually on this bike, what he had was super heavy. This was a, a metal, big metal can. So, I mean, it's not, it was huge too. But yet, I mean, I kind of see it has to fit my helmet and has to fit what I need it to fit. Come on, buddy. Has to do the job for me. And this one does. Got a lot of transformers on three here. We'll see how well it works out. Transformers! <laughs> I have another movie coming out for it, for them. I guess we need another one. we won't know if this actually does work until after I get down to the homestead and uh, pop it into my laptop which is okay it's okay it's okay we'll be all right Looks like we got a breakdown or something it used to be this used to be all brick Ah. The flick of a wrist. Come on, buddy. I think they did a nice job with this area. Hi, kids. I've been through here many times with some video. But on the 18th, well actually I believe it was on the 17th I might be. It's either the 18th or the 17th I'll be heading out to... Huh. I'll be heading over back over to Ohio. And hopefully, maybe I'll meet up with Skip and Rex and the Buckeye Hoys. The 
Emerson Pump Station. Let's turn there. This time we'll, freak, we'll remember to turn the light off, the blinker off. Clean here. Do I know where I'm at? Yeah, I do. It don't matter. Looking good. This should be a pretty good thorough test. Hopefully. This one right here, you gotta edge out. Peek around the corner. Oh, that's pretty pretty. Let's turn here. This is being a test. This is Muzzle Mike. Say, I'll talk to you guys all later. I hope you guys have a good day. Bye-bye.